Ever had a pressing question and wanted the opinion of everyone, or at least those who have mastered search engine optimization? I'll give you your conclusions to be drawn from the internet, because baby needs a new pair of shoes. Also, judging from the expression of spangly tiara, right? How will we find these answers? A good old-fashioned Google search, of course. I'll sort through the top 10 or 20 results to deliver to you the most popular and therefore totally accurate conclusions. In today's episode, we forego Jungian analysis and journaling and cut to the chase about the state of your psyche. Today's question is, what do my strange dreams mean? In all your dreams, do you seem to be like the main character? Are you making your way through a stone maze, shaping a piece of wood when you realize that you have split ends? Or are you hanging out with your minister, eating an apple, and looking for somewhere to pee? You ate potatoes four hours before bed. Please also see alcohol. I was in my bedroom, and I was a blanket, and this sewing machine kept getting closer and closer, but never reached me. I woke up with this chant going on in my head, Goodbye, horse. Goodbye. Then I was trying to help this deer who was stuck in the mud, and my husband got mad at me for also being stuck in the mud. Did your dreams come through gates of horn or ivory, or was the door made for a giraffe? The blueness represents sadness. The mansion represents hugeness. The pizza represents eating. Don't listen to what Pepper says. You just have indigestion. Baby water keeps you young. Thank you for watching Conclusions to be Drawn from the Internet. Join me next time as I ask, how do I use my stuff? Hey, why just the shoes? Are you into new jogging? Mm -hmm. Goodbye, horse, goodbye. I'm surprised you haven't tried barefoot running. Or running. Or walking.